We may receive a child protection report in our agency that we don't screen in as a need for services, but we do have some concerns. And so we can offer voluntary services. Um, and that's called, that program is called PSOP, Parent Support Outreach Program. And we would contact the family and let them know just that we've received a report. Um, we'd like to extend voluntary services. If you'd have us, we'd like to come and meet with you and work with you. Um, we would go in with the family, meet them, and kind of talk with them about what's happening in their family and what services and supports we might have available. And if they're interested, um, working with us voluntarily, we might make a referral and assist them with receiving some services. I'd say one of the most difficult cases I ever had to work with was um, I had a mom come to our agency with Huntington's disease. The mother had come to us and asked for help with her children because she knew she was going to die. And I worked with that family for three and a half years before I quit working for that agency. But watching that mother in a rapid decline through our child welfare services, which are voluntary, and having a mom that was that vulnerable and willing to ask for the help, and it really put me in a different situation on my job because usually it's us going into homes where they don't want our help. And it really challenged me as a professional to look at the job differently that some of these people want our help and being able to give them those services and resources and really challenging myself to get what was needed for those kids set up so this mom could go on with her disease and know that her kids were gonna be okay. And uh, mom is still alive. She is now pretty much immobile and in a nursing home, but just knowing that her kids have all been adopted and are safe and she's still seeing her kids. But it was just a very hard, a hard scenario to watch from start to finish because she walked in as a healthy everyday person and you would not have known she was sick to watching her become where she could she can barely talk.